Hi everyone, it's Mary from Pocket Fitness UK. So today we're here doing a free taster session of women's weight training. Um, today I'm going to be using a barbell, but you can use dumbbells, you could use with a kettlebell. Um, it's just it's just a question of where you hold them in each exercise. Um, but if you have a barbell, that's what we're going to use. If you have a step, that would be great. It's something to lie down on, just to give you a bit of resistance when you're doing chest presses. But if you don't have a step, it doesn't matter. You can still do it all on the ground, on the floor. It's not a problem. So we're going to start getting warmed up to begin with. Get some music on. Open up 
and out, elbows and out. Right, have your wrists around, lift up your wrists, your forearms. And yourself a shake. Give a quick break. Right, so we're going to start off, as I said, the barbell squats again, using dumbbells. You put them on your shoulders or down by your sides. Using a cowbell, you turn upside down and squat down with it. With using a barbell, it goes up into your back across your shoulders so you can feel it. It's comfortable. It's resting on your neck, it's really uncomfortable and it hurts. So you know when it's right, because it's not uncomfortable having it just like there. We're going to come down for eight. Seven, sit right back into your heels. Four, three, two, and one. Push it up, doing that raises. Hands in the middle, make sure the bell is balanced, nice tight core, coming up for eight, five, four, three, two, and one, back to your squats again, onto your shoulders, down for eight, seven, six, Four, three, two, last one. That's that raises, data, pulling up. Seven and eight. Thank you, Scott, the end. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, plus one. And that raises again for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Again. Have a shake, have a drink if you need it. Now, see what this message is. Okay, right there. So, this time <coughs> we're going to do lunge pulses with barbell again. Using dumbbells for cowbell. Zap it like you it for the squats. Bump into your back. So, we'll do it one side at a time. Take a nice deep step forward, deep lunge. And now, for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Same size. <coughs> Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. This time we're doing that pull down. You start with the bar up nice and high. You're going to come down <coughs> behind your head. If you come down, you can squeeze your shoulder blades together. Again, nice tight core. Don't arch your back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Back to your lunge pulses again. Step forward one leg. And drop down for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two and one. Change sides. So eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! We're back to that pull down. Start up high. Coming down. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Right, last set. <coughs> Lunges, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. 
And again, on the side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back to that pull down. Up high. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Super job. Put your weights down. You want to shake? And grab a drink. <coughs> so we're going to move into working your biceps a bit more shoulders. I'm going to drop my weight down a little bit because I know for my shoulders it will be a bit too heavy. Um, so this it's totally up to you. Obviously, you want to make it more intense. <coughs> Keep your weight heavy. So the bicep curls, you want to make sure you keep your elbows in, <coughs> tight to the body, nice straight back, tight core. Again, pull your pelvis under so you're not arching your back. And curl up nice and slowly for eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, two, one. Shoulder press and turn your hands around. Again, tight core. Start with it in front. Coming up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back onto your biceps. Again, if you're using dumbbells, exactly the same motion. Capital bell, you can do it single arms. Um, a set for each on each single arm. So you can do two arms together, curling up towards you. <coughs> Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Change hands, take over the shoulders, here we go, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, last set. <coughs> Ooh, here we go, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. All right, last time my shoulders. I'm pushing up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Very good. Put the weights down. Give it on the shake. Have a drink you need it. Right, so we're going to move on to some chest work. <coughs> if you have a step, I'm going to put that down so you've got something to lie on. Give you some distance. Again, you can do these with dumbbells and a kettlebell. Not a problem. Right, so we're going to do chest press for eight. And then pullovers. <coughs> I suggest if you're doing pullovers for the first time that you have much lighter weight. It's quite intense on this part of your body just here, um, right in your pectoral muscles, and just as your shoulder muscles come into play. Um, it is very intense, so if you need to do a little bit lighter weight or change in between, that's absolutely fine. So if you're on a step, you want to make sure you're right on the edge of it. So you can lie down. <coughs> you can see me. So we're here. You chest press. You want your hands flat down, put it to the shoulders. You want the bar just across the top of your chest. That's your boot, basically. We're coming up to eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 
warm. If you're on the floor, make sure when you're coming down, just at the skirt, sorry, that your elbows are back around to the back. You've got some resistance, some bit of gravity pulling in. The pullovers, you're going to start with the weight across your cubic bone. You're going to come up over your head. Try to keep your back flat to the floor. Don't let the weight touch the floor when it comes over. Chest press here, pressing up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Back to pull overs here, and back, eight, seven, engage the core, push your back right back to the floor, just come over, so not arching your back. Manage. 
sitting back flat on the fish all as well before. You're coming up for eight, seven, or really squeeze the top in your bum cheeks. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now it's time. You want to hold the count four. So four, three, two, one, and down. <coughs> and again. Four, three, two, one, and down. Again. Four, three, two, one, and down. Four, three, two, one, and down. Good. Give a little bit of a shake. So very good for your bum and hamstrings. So we're going to start again for eight. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We'll lift and hold for four, three, two, one. And again, four, three, two, one. Again, lift to four, three, two, one. One more time. Four, three, two, and one. Legs are a little shake. Right. Last time, if we break singles, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We're going to lift the ball for four, three, two, and one. Again, four, three, two, one. <coughs> Again, four, three, Two, one, last time, and four, three, two, and one. Good job. Big weight down. Don't forget. Right, we're going to do a step out of the way, the usual one. Have a quick drink. And we're going to finish off with an all over body exercises. Pretty much incorporates pretty much everything we've just done. You can start with the bell, the barbell, I mean. You can do this with kettlebells. You might want to do one side and the other side. You can do this with dumbbells, exact same position. So you're going to start with the bench row, to your chest, stand up, to your chest, push up, come down. Your hips, to your knees. So it's knees, to chest, knees, hips, shoulders, up, shoulders, hips, knees. Chest, knees, hips, shoulders, up, hips, knees. Chest, knees, shoulders, up, hips, and knees. Again, push up. And down, chest, hips, knee, the shoulders, chest, hips, and knees, chest to knees, hips, and push up. Do a few more. Work everything. Last one, hips, chest, push up, knees, and down. Pretty good. Tip stuff. So, that's a really quick weight training exercise. Move everything out of the way. Whew, a bit fussy. Now, if you want to make it a bit more intense, you can always uh, add more weight, use heavy weights. Again, do the same workout two or three times. That will give you at least an hour's workout of weights if you wanted to do that. Um, let's put some slow music on. And we will do some stretching. There we go. Woo! Big breath in. 
and out, and in, and out. Arm across, look over the shoulder you pull in, back pull on the elbow, <coughs> and the other side. Relax, arm up, reach through between shoulder blades, relax, other side, and relax, and close the fingers, push away, Feel this down the back of your arms and across the top of your shoulders. Up to the ceiling. Over one side. And ceiling again. And over the other side. To the ceiling. Stretch up. So elongate the diaphragm with your ribcage. Stretch out down the back. Keep that tension. Drop down in front, keep pushing away. Yeah, go with it. All the way down to the facing floor. Push down to the floor. Stretch out across the top of your back. Your fingers roll up slowly. Take a little step forwards. Put on that so you can see me. There we go. So lift those toes up towards your body. Bend this standing leg. Sit back into your heel. Feel the stretch right down the back of your leg into your hamstring, especially after doing bridges. <coughs> oh, that's a nice stretch. And the other side, exact same thing. <coughs> and relax. You're going to take one big step forward. Keep the back heel flat on the floor. On me. Make sure you can still see your toes over the Bentley. Push arms forward. Feel the stretch down your leg into your calf. And change sides. Same thing. Make sure your back, your heels stay flat on the floor. Push into the front. And relax. Another big breath in, and out, one more, and out. Brilliant stuff. Oh, that's women's weight training. Um, very quick, well, half an hour workout. <coughs> Excuse me, half an hour workout. Give you some ideas for some weight training. Uh, worked everything today. Um, all those workout using your barbell, as again, as I said, you can do that with dumbbells or a kettlebell, or interchange it, a workout, do a bit of each, depending on how you feel. Again, you want to make it more intense, do heavier weights, do more sets, or do the whole workout two or three times through. Um, that'll give you a really good all over workout using weights. If you're interested in stuff like that, join my sessions on uh, Tuesdays and Friday mornings at 10. Um, just message me, and I'll send you the link on how you can join. Um, and all the other details. So I hope you enjoyed that. I have. Um, so hopefully if you've got any comments, any questions, please get in touch. Love to hear it. And hopefully I will see you next time. Bye for now.